Good morning, everybody. Good morning. It's JPR, and we just got done streaming, and I am super heck -a tired right now. But apparently, while I was streaming, we got another new trailer for Pokemon Sun and Moon with another split second new glimpse of gameplay footage, just like we had on Friday. So, in this singular screenshot, and I know what you're thinking, JPR, why are you making a video about this one screenshot? What is so important about it? And honestly, it's not that important. I mean, it's not incredibly mind-blowing or anything. I just wanted to point out a few new things about this that we have not seen yet. The main thing you probably already noticed is the HP bar. The HP bar is looking much more different in this generation than it was before. As you can see, it's no longer like completely rectangular. Like one side is like slightly wider than the other. Uh, so it does kind of match like that more relaxed modern feel of uh, the era that we're in right now. You see that with a lot of company logos right now is they're going to more simplistic and less rigid type of uh, designs. And it is going to take a little bit of getting used to this new HP bar since we've had pretty much the same one for the last six generations. Uh, but I am open to it. I am not going to complain because I think this actually looks very welcoming to new players of the game. They're going to look at that and they're going to be pretty impressed with it. I also like the little gradient in there. It's darker on one side and lighter on the other. That looks pretty nice as well. Now this is not the exact same screenshot that we got earlier this week with the previous rival battle. It turns out this is actually going to be the second rival battle in the game, or I would assume it's the second one in the game since you still have the basic unevolved starter Pokemon, which makes sense because usually you have a rival battle right off the bat as soon as the game starts, and then one just a little bit later after that. But the thing that I really like about this screenshot as compared to the other one is that it pretty much confirms that no matter where you are in the overworld, the battle scenery is going to reflect that, and that is so crazy to just wrap your head around. And look, even in the background, you have spectators, and that is just amazing how they're able to have, like, not just the models of the Pokemon and the trainer in there and have it run smoothly, but also have the 3D models of spectators in the background in addition to all of that scenery that we didn't have before. So what do you guys think of this new battle scene? The more and more of it that we see, the more and more that I am impressed with it. So be sure to leave your thoughts down below, subscribe for more videos like this one, and I'll see you guys next time.